system in which heat is extracted from outside air and taken inside the home, even in below freezing temperatures. The technology involved is not new, since many people have been using heat pumps in the southern part of the country for nearly 20 years. However, with the onset of higher fuel prices, the heat pump principle is becoming more attractive to us northerners too. Even though the installation of a heat pump to an existing furnace could cost from two to $4,000 or more, the homeowner could realize a savings over the long term. Steve Plain, Vice President of Engineering, Design, and Production at Fowler Train Air Conditioning Company, explains the fuel cost savings to the consumer. The biggest savings we find right now are, uh, because of the, the current rates of fuels, uh, would be on oil, which would can vary, depending on the size of the system, anywhere from, say, 30 to 40%. Uh, propane a little greater because of the current cost of propane, uh, 35 to 45 perhaps. Uh, on natural gas, uh, which is the most effective way of heating in this area right now, uh, we're down around the 4 to 10 percent range. Uh, that still is cost effective, particularly if you're concerned about cooling your home during the summer. One of the advantages of a heat pump is that it not only reduces your fuel bill heating in the, in the winter, but it also provides air conditioning. Since the heat pump is not efficient below 20 degrees, it is recommended that it be used in conjunction with a conventional system in what is called a dual fuel system. It should be noted, too, that some existing heating systems, like the old gravity flow system, do not lend themselves to such conversion. The heat pump system of heating one's home is certainly not the cure-all for everyone's energy woes, but it does offer a reasonable alternative.